Hello everyone, Genesis here with another Genesis Tips and Tricks video. Today we'll be looking at the map Adrift and some free-for-all SWAT gameplay. You can either choose the Battle Rifle or the DMR. Now this is in the Global Championship playlist. Uh, it changes every week the game types that they play. And this week it happens to be free-for-all SWAT. Now again, a lot of the maps are broken, but this is a three-minute game with 25 kills, one death, and, f and one overkill. Now, I want to specifically point out what I'll be doing. I will be patrolling this area, this area right here, and this hallway. Okay? These are the main areas I will be patrolling. I almost did not upload this video because of the amount that I stay in one place, which can be considered camping, and I definitely do realize that. However, I think camping refers to someone who stays in a corner the entire game and doesn't move, okay? I am constantly moving, constantly checking my angles, constantly being aware of the enemy team is, and if this video does not convince you to buy a surround sound headset, I, I really don't know what will. So off the spawn here, I know where this guy's gonna spawn. I've played the playlist before. It's really dumb how you spawn in front of someone. I don't under quite understand it, but that's how it is. The same guy, I cast the same guy. I know this guy's gonna be in that general location because that's his general spawn point below there. And he'll be coming up the stairs. Now here again, I'm checking my angles, making sure where things are. End up seeing this guy in the hallway. What, look at what I do here. Notice how I find the second guy because that first guy I killed was looking at someone. Look at my top right hand corner of the screen. I haven't reloaded. This is a constant problem with people in SWAT. Never reload when you're about to go around some more corners. Only reload once you get into a safe location. Look how I still have not reloaded. Okay? Even I still have not reloaded. Now I realize I'm going to have to reload really soon here, so I pull back into the corner and reload. Again, I'm using my headset to determine, hey look, that guy just came over the lift, and I knew he was going to come over the lift because of my headset. I can hear when he lifts over. Now, I do hear a lift sound, but that's actually the lift behind me in the hallway. I hear that guy coming over the lift. And I hear some more footsteps in the hallway. Yes, you can hear footsteps. Normally, in team-based games, I have my headset turned down a little bit and my teammate's voice turned up a little bit. So, in this game, I don't. Now, notice how what I do here. This That guy comes sprinting around the corner. This guy. Okay? And I jump up on top, onto the box and completely avoid him as he comes around the corner. He's thinking I'm going to be behind the boxes again. So I hop up on that box. Again, slightly moving my position constantly. That guy spawns back there. Very unfortunate for him for the running riot kill. Check. There's a guy. I pull back. Now... At this point in the game, people are frantic. They start lifting, they start sprinting. Neither of which you want to do. That's my only death in the game. Neither which you ever want to do on a drift unless you're already ahead. If you're already ahead, go ahead and start sprinting occasionally or lifting. Okay? And if you have to lift, always sprint into the lift. Always. Okay? And very soon here, the game will end. Again, this game is... I think uh, 2 minutes and 52 seconds, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 2 minutes and 52 seconds right there on the black screen. And yes, this is my gameplay. And this will be the end of the game here. Guys, if that helped you understand how to play SWAT Free For All a little bit more, I know SWAT Free For All won't be in the game after this week. But if that helped you understand how to play SWAT free-for-all or helped you see a new strategy that you didn't know about, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video or whatever I make. Peace, guys.